This is John Young with The Weekend Handyman. We are at the GIE Show here in Louisville, Kentucky, looking at the cool things here on the exhibit floor. And that brought me over to the Frog Pond Manufacturing booth with the Pug. I've got Joe here. Joe, this is kind of cool. I've, I don't think I've seen anything like this. Tell me about the Pug. Well, the Pug's a very unique utility vehicle. They started building them back, actually back in 1966, and we got the company a couple of years ago. It's, it's just a heavy-duty, real workhorse, okay? It's not really a toy. It's not made to ride real pretty. You're not going to run through the woods at 20 miles and come out with any teeth okay as you can see on the front end here we have a reinforced front bumper that's to handle a six foot hydraulic snow blade okay they're used a lot up north and in Canada to push large volumes of snow around they get very good traction in the snow as they are all-time four-wheel drive okay the all-time four-wheel drive is powered by a Kohler engine which we'll look at here in a few moments and uh, it is electronic fuel injected Kohler engine has a five-speed Muncie transmission with Dana Spicer running gears okay so everything that I've talked about there is made here in the USA As you can see we have a 12 volt cell phone charger everyone needs a cell phone charger so we do have that there uh, we don't call them cigarette lighters anymore those are cell phone chargers yeah, okay is. does have a glove box built in down here for you to put your gloves in emergency brake that brake actually is onto the shaft of the transmission so it locks it there rather than having to depend on the uh, hub brakes that we have inside the wheels okay yeah. has power steering hydraulic steering actually that is uh, controlled by a Parker D11 pump that's made here uh, down in Tennessee again made in the USA okay nice uh, the uh, other hydraulic controls the steering column and the steering actuator on the bottom of the steering column is also Parker the uh, spool valve that handles the dump bed and the front end plow is a Prince that is also made in the USA okay as you can see we're looking at a Kohler 21 horse engine this is actually a 20 and a half it's a carbureted model uh, the most common one we're putting out today is an electronic fuel injected 21 horse Kohler engine that's backed up by the Muncie five-speed transmission and and uh, of course on down here you see the Dana Spicer running gears okay uh, all of this the, all of this made in the USA As you move back here to the middle you can see our patented swivel yoke okay that is what enables the uh, back end of the machine to go up to a like a 17 18 degree turn in other words the front can be setting level and the back end can be up on a hillside and it doesn't affect the, the pulling or the running of the machine. The swivel yoke uh, comes off of the transmission. Uh, moving on back to the back end, you can see where we do use the steel and steel braided brake lines with uh, neoprene covers on them. To uh, They're slick and they kind of let brush and stuff slide off of them rather than catching on them like the old steel lines. And uh, we offer, offer it in uh, three different tire treads. This one here in particular has the turf tread. We also have a, a, a small lug and then an aggressive lug, more agriculture or, you know, work tire, so to speak. Joe, if people want to find out more information about the Pug, where can they go? Well, you can go to PUGUTV.com or at any time anyone can uh, not hesitate to call a company at 606-872-1681 and uh, we will answer any questions that you may have.